New at 5.30, we now know what is about to happen to Orlando Health's Hubbard House. This is a place where out-of-town families called home, and it closed last year after being a fixture for more than 20 years. Now News 6's Clay Lepard explains the whole building is about to come down to make way for easier access. It's warm out here. Laps around Lake Beauty keep Lori Roberts busy. She's commuting from Winter Haven while one of her grandsons recovers from open heart surgery. Come on. For Roberts, part of the area's beauty comes from the Hubbard House. It's heartbreaking because it's like a landmark. News 6 was there as OUC crews shut off the water to the property. It's one of the first steps before Orlando health officials say it will be demolished to make way for a parking lot. It's a blessing. For years, the building was a home away from home for out-of-towners whose loved ones were being treated at Orlando Health. We never turn anybody down for inability to pay. Veterans spruced up the building back in 2015, before it closed in December of last year after reports of costly repairs. Volunteers called the closing a shame, saying Hubbard House was a gift to the community. It's a gift Lori Roberts wishes was still available. It is close to the hospital, and, and to know that you could have stayed there, I mean, it's just a wonderful-looking building, and as well as what it could grant a lot of families who really need a place to stay. In a statement to News 6, an Orlando Health spokesperson said, said in part, the parking area will make it more convenient for our patients, families, and visitors of ORMC's emergency department and level one trauma center. And it will add free self-parking options to the existing valet only lot. We've asked Orlando Health, but it's still not quite clear when exactly this building will be coming down and that parking lot will be going in. In Orlando, Clay Lepard getting results, News 6.